So now let me show you our automatic closing system for liquid detergent production. Okay, so all the system start with uh, uh, raw material preparation. So here we have this uh, storage tank for raw water from tap water or from groundwater. And there we have our uh, water treatment units, okay, to filter and uh, deionize water uh, to get our water. Uh, and then we will transfer this uh, water up to this uh, solid tank or deionize the water, or we call it our water. And here we have uh, the transfer system for those chemicals uh, with this uh, rotor pump and this one for LAPSA. There we have uh, the pump for CDA and CAB and AO9 and uh, brain. A brain from uh, uh, our uh, uh, from salt, and also now we have this uh, um, transfer pump for SLES because SLES cannot flow by gravity, so we need another transfer pump from the solid tank into the mixers. Okay, uh, but all the other chemicals, including our water, they can. Uh, flow by gravity into the mixers. As you can see, the head of um, uh, the level of uh, this storage tank, uh, it's above the mixers. So all these uh, ingredients, including our water and chemicals, can flow by gravity into the mixers. And, uh, but as it is, it cannot flow by gra gravity because of the, its viscosity. And here we have an uh, additional uh, mixer for uh, mixing salt with water to prepare our brain. And we will transfer this. Uh, now we are transferring this uh, brain into this uh, storage tank up there. And here we have this uh, operation platform. We have two mixers here. Uh, here one mixer for three ton per batch, and this one five ton per batch means uh, five thousand liter per batch and three thousand liter per batch. So all these chemical solid tanks, including our water tank, is uh, connected with these uh, mixers by uh, pipes and uh, it's the flow will be controlled by uh, these uh, pneumatic valves, automatic pneuma pneumatic valves, okay? Uh, powered by air, compressed air and we have the load cells, load cells, four load cells for each of the mixing tank, okay? And here we have our dosing system. Uh, with a PLC, okay, and, uh, and log in. So we have this uh, uh, dashboard, and here in this uh, on this page, we can uh, set our uh, pre uh, formulations or recipes. So, for example, now for this one, we can change the name. This is called uh, hand soap, okay, liquid, and the other one. And we will we can input all these uh, chemicals, and for each of them, we will have the uh, the dosing quantity for each of them, okay. And then here on this uh, dosing uh, dashboard, we can select formulation, okay. We're gonna select the first one and confirm. So, and here, all, uh, the formula name is called uh, hand soap liquid and the other one. Okay, now we can start dosing. Okay, so we can start, uh, for example, water. We dose water. So now, let's start dosing with uh, uh, water. Start 
dosing, the PLC will send signal to this uh, uh, valve to open the valve for water dosing. Now, uh, water is being dosed into this mixer. Okay. Uh, So when it reaches to the setting point, uh, se the pneumatic valve will stop, will close, and the water will, uh, the water dosing will be stopped automatically. And it goes one by one, okay, for the other chemicals.